Learn to let go. Let go of that grip that you have on your life where you are planning everything out and you expect everything to go exactly as you want it to go. I am a planner and I'm a perfectionist and I make timelines in my head and I want this, this, and this to happen all in this order and this is exactly what I think would be best for me. I've recently been working on letting it go because when you limit yourself to what you believe, you are actually limiting yourself from everything that could be coming into your life. Things that you don't even have any idea are out there are going to start happening. This weekend I have two examples of it. Yesterday I was in church and I love our church choir, love our church choir. And I have been looking for a CD of them for a year, for a year. I have searched everywhere, I've gone to the gift shop at the back of church before, I've gone online and I've only found a YouTube video that I just watch over and over. Yesterday, at the very end of Mass, the priest says, oh yeah, we're selling all of our CDs in the back of church, of our church choir. I went, what? What? All of the CDs? I couldn't find a one, but it wasn't until I just let go and let blessings come into my life that this happened. Then I walked in to work today, and I've been really working on learning how to meditate and bring meditation more into my life. Sitting on my desk, a coworker left this, the new mindfulness, bought this magazine for me. He has no idea that I'm trying to learn how to meditate better. And it's an entire magazine with tips and tricks and different stories about meditating. <sighs> you gotta let go. You gotta learn to not try to be in control of everything. Give it up to someone else and you will see all the blessings that come into your life.